about my siblings. I literally lost four of my siblings. Wow. In, in the space of how long? Mm, from 2006 to 2019. Wow. Ever since then, I'm usually like, whose turn is it? Because we just train now. And, you know, I mean, I, I don't even know, but the truth is... When you, when, when you lost them, how did you feel? It was hard for me in 2019 when I lost my other sister. What was how, how hard? I don't understand. I felt really bad because I... It was looking like a custom in my family. You know, so I was scared because I don't know who is the next. I was really scared. Good. So let me ask you a question. Are you living from your past or your future or your present? No. I, I mean, I can, I can never live in my past. You're living, are you living from your past? No, no, no. The way you're afraid of the future, are you living from your past, present, or future? Although I feel different now. You feel different now. now. But if before I, now, we are living from where? Your past, right? You know, memories, so... <laughs> what is it? With memories, you know? With memories. Yeah. Yeah, same thing. So the thing is, is look at me. I want to say something powerful. If you live in your past, you will repeat your past. So if you keep saying that this is what happens how they die, then that death will come from your past and come into your future. The way to recreate your past is to live in it, in your mind, and to recreate itself. Never allow your tragedy affect your theology. 